how could we communicate with stars out there that potentially have life? Well, we can think of creating a kind of long-range internet, either through the use of uh, radio waves or perhaps um, visible light. So these would be the kinds of signals that we could generate in the case of lower energy signals like radio waves relatively cheaply. And we could broadcast, if we came up with a suitable code, um, some way of transmitting information over galactic and intergalactic distances. But we would get an answer back in 800,000 years, maybe, <laughs> or two and a half million years. Well, I think that the more one looks for planets in the universe beyond our solar system that are potentially places that might be hospitable to life, the more you appreciate the wonderful planet that we have here that allows us to do things like swim in an ocean, breathe the air without um, the help of our technology. And so, you know, while I would like us to explore Mars more, I think the only thing that we've demonstrated is that we're very good at destroying the habitability of Earth um, rather than improving the habitability of a completely alien world. The idea that Mars will somehow save us from the decisions we've made here is a false one. And um, it's a little like saying that you're going to go live in the lifeboat when, you know, even lifeboats need somewhere to land.